Anyway, we're at the SPCA. We are about to adapt. Um, hey, so I, I sorry. I'm sorry. I'm we're, not. We're at the SBCA and we, well, I was on Facebook, I want to say yesterday. Was it yesterday? Day before? Two days ago. Two days ago. And I seen on Facebook stories, we have Monmouth County SBCA. Um, we have them on our Facebook. And so we actually were, I was watching their stories and I seen they had two guinea pigs that were um, surrendered because the owner um, became allergic to them. So, I, and they were two boys and I was like, oh, Orlo! So I showed her, their names are Chili and Cookie. Chili's the white one. Cookie is the calico one. And so guess what we did? We adopted them. They're, we're, we're, they're parents being pro again. we're parents again. They're being processed right now. Um, they'll bring them out to us. They're in this cute little carrier. How cute. We don't even have a guinea pig carrier. That's pretty awesome that that we do now. And it comes with, they come with their own little cage. I mean, it's collapsed now, but you'll see it when we get home. They've got like nice clean fleece, everything. Like we don't even need to put bedding down right now for them. So I'm super excited about all of this. So, yeah. We came home ravenous. As soon as we set up the boys, I got to work. I know. I actually did some cooking today. Mm. Um, I made some punsit. <clears throat> so good. It's been a while. And then we have some wings and uh, leftover fried ravioli. I almost didn't get that out mm -hmm. right. I heard it. Uh huh. There's the fried ravioli. There's the wings and there's the punsit. Mm. So good. Oh. Look at that. I use kelp noodles for that. Mm-hmm. Morning. Ooh, I smell the cinnamon. We're having breakfast. Uh, Dana made no meal. I have, hold on, a peanut butter note meal. I like peanut butter. I used to have peanut butter in, in my meal all the time, so that's how I like it, and that's how Dana makes it for me. And then I have three fried eggs. Dana has... Cinnamon maple. There you go. Cinnamon maple. A little bit of butter on top eggs and she got the recipe for the note meal on keto connects website okay so we're at the new house and so i don't know did you guys see that we've painted the cab the counters like a uh, concrete gray it's really nice but let me show you after we painted them a concrete gray we then sprayed this stuff if you've ever seen it it's amazing um it's called yeah. For solely American accents, stop. Yeah, what she said. Um, so it's like gray and it has specks of black in it. It's got like these really pretty like apricot specks in it, like that color, like a peachy. Look at what it does to the cabinet. What cabinets? The counters. Let me show you better lighting over here. It gives it that like speckled look where so that the counters don't look, they actually look like they, like we had them done. It's insane. Look at that. Wow, I am pleased. How you feel? Hot. I know, we're done. We're totally done. So you're supposed to let them uh, dry 15 minutes in between each coat, but we're only putting one coat. We don't want to overkill it with the speckled look. But you know why? It's because we also primed, uh, primed and painted like the gray color, so. Yeah, so that color, well, let me show you the, the cap of the other one. Oh, oh here it is. Okay. So here, this is the cap. So this up here is what it then looks like. But we had this gray already, like similar. The gray's over there in the pink. In the well, gray. they've seen it already because I had the vlog camera here the other day. Oh. Um, but so this just adds like a speckled look and I absolutely adore it. So now we just have to put these top layers of, what is it that we're putting on? It gives it that like gloss, right? Top coats. Top coats and that's it. We're done with the kitchen. 
exciting. We'll put all the cabinets back up like the doors and put the hardware on and yeah. This is awesome. You ready? Yes. I'm ready. Like we're, we weren't even in here long and it's hot. It's a really hot day today, so. Anyway, so we brought a couple of things over just to get it out of the garage. A Little bit here, a little bit there. You know, oh look, I have a hat right here. I'm about to put this hat on. Cause I am so sweating. Oh yes, please. I look crazy, but I don't care. What's that? Oh, okay. Anyway, so she'll show you what the top coat looks First, like. I'm gonna put on the sand and say just yeah, whatever she said. We, she's been doing tons of research. I researched the stone spray stuff here, um, and yeah, it's it makes it look because the gray was really nice on here, just like the flat gray, but that speckle look just makes it look. 10 times nicer. It actually looks like a counter now, you know what I mean? Instead of like just, you know, a piece of whatever. You know what I looked up? The best top coat or clear coat for painted surfaces. And this is so what she got. This is sanding sealer and then I'll put like a sealer on top of that. There it is. Exciting, you better make sure there's ventilation in here. Yeah. Cause this shit stinks right now. Yeah. Anyway, so we're we out. Mm -hmm. We're leaving. Let me shut the light off. It's not even one o'clock yet. I know we weren't here very long. We got this done. It looks amazing. Hey, can you take a picture for my mom to show her? I did. Did the speckle look? Yeah. Oh, cool. All right. So I'm shutting the light off. Five, we have. Let me see. Oh man, we have our new stove and new refrigerator coming on Wednesday. My birthday. Yep, today's Monday. My birthday is on Thursday. The guinea pigs, the new guys, they go to the um, to the vet, to the vet on, on Thursday in the morning. They have an 8:30 appointment, so early, but whatever. And uh, Arlo's off Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So exciting! We're gonna do a lot of packing on Friday. So I will see you guys later. We have been MIA today. Today is Wednesday. Sorry, you had lint on you. All right. Don't think um, well, I'm trying to get it off. It was distracting. They were distracting. Mm. It's um Wednesday, July 29th. It's the day before Dana's birthday. She's going to be 44 if you didn't know. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we went to Target. We had to pick up something that Austin had ordered. And then we went to... Did we go anywhere else? I don't know. Couldn't you have it? Oh, we went to Big Lots. And then we went to the house because I had to put on another pin. Uh, uh, a, a layer of... of Top coat. Here's dinner. Okay, um, zucchini fritters, crab cake, and then uh, fried calamari with some uh, sour cream and salt and pepper, and then that's the garlic aioli I made last week. And then a sparkling ice. Mine's black raspberry. Dana's got cherry vanilla. Hi, it is my birthday, July 30th. And we just brought the babies over here to the vet. They had an 8.30 appointment, which was really early, but happy I took them. So Paulie, little white guy right there, little white guinea pig, he has a possible ear infection, which is what is causing him to kind of act the way he's been acting. But it seems like it might be getting a little better, which I'm grateful for. He's also got some facial paralysis that is possibly from the ear. Everything's connected. Um, so they gave us, we're gonna get pain medicine for him, antibiotics. Um, we're waiting on the pain medicine to come. The antibiotics we're gonna pick up in a little bit. And an eye lubricant, because his eye was a little wonky. So for some reason he's not able to close his eye completely so it's not being lubricated enough. So this will help that, it's every 12 hours. Before I go to bed tonight, he'll get another drop. He gets one drop every 12 hours. But other than that, he's eating well, he's doing better, his eye even looks better. So, if she would have seen his eye the other day, like it looks so much better than it looked the other day. So, we're happy about that. We're gonna go get them some peppers. They need vitamin C. And then we're gonna have sushi tonight, which is exciting, so that's that. That's it. Good morning. I have not picked up the camera in two days. I had a stiff neck yesterday and it didn't feel too good and it still kind of hurts today. It's there, it, like it's lingering. 
uh, yeah, then we've been busy trying to get this house together because now we're moving in, what, 17 days, 16 days, whatever it may be. So there's a lot going on. But anyway, so Samantha, let me show you. She made her own breakfast. There she is. She made uh, French toast cinnamon sticks and she likes them a lot and she made them herself and we used the 647 bread right there and you know we used pure um cinnamon eggs vanilla you know so i'm making myself a coffee right now because it's coffee time and i figured i'd pick up the camera and say howdy anywho so i'm gonna show you my coffee been um, a couple days since I've, I've been on here yesterday I just said it's been a couple days since oh, I've yes, been on you, here yes. so today is what's what's the the fourth of August it's Tuesday today there was um was it a tropical storm no that was a hurricane hurricane Esaias 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 whatever anyway a whole lot of uh, winds we lost Hello, power. Rain, some rain. We lost power. Uh huh. Oh yeah, there was a tornado in uh, South Jersey today. Um, Dana's not decent, so I gotta watch what you do. Back up slowly. But um, yeah, we lost power at 11:30 this morning, and then we didn't get it back until 7:40. We cooked dinner. By daylight. <laughs> it was feeding, but uh, we had some hot dogs and I know, right? Fabulous dinner. And um, tuna noodles. <laughs> tuna noodle. Just, you know, cold tuna and yeah. pasta with some mayo, salt, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, you know, just one of them deals. And then Dana just cleaned the guinea pig cages. We were supposed to do a lot of shit today. We were supposed to be in the garage today, you know, packing. But I guess that's just going to be tomorrow. I have a dentist appointment tomorrow at 2. I actually have a, um, a crown that got loose. I was chewing a piece of gum a couple weeks ago and came off. But uh, we did go to the house today. We took off. We took off. We took off uh, the tape, the, the plastic, and we are so excited. Uh, oh, yeah. I started putting on some of the doors, and then Dana was also putting on some of the knobs that we had bought. Oh yeah. We have to go look for um, outlet covers. We want a specific color. I don't know if Dana told you, but I'm not going to. You'll see it when it happens, but. Oh yeah, red. Oh, okay, red. Well, I mean, they've been seeing what the kids have been looking at. I don't remember the last time they saw. Uh, I should. Cabinets are painted, the backsplash is painted, the counters are gorgeous. Mm -hmm. I'm excited for them. And then we were going to set up the, um, the stainless steel island, but Dana was aggravated, which was aggravating me because it was hot and there was still no electricity, and she, she doesn't like the tedious things like you know how i have to do things my way and i had to tape every little bit of everything and things weren't coming off and she was getting pissed off because apparently patience is my forte yes patience is yours i rather do like big sweaty jobs that she it's, wants to be big and sweaty no 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 but it's no she wants to do like right? the brute it's, it's, it's fishing here close your legs no, um, she likes to do like the brute force work and I will be there doing the delicate things. I prefer like the manly jobs. 
So what are my jobs? Bitchy jobs. Yeah, but if it requires them, so patience, you were supposed, well, you told if them it that, requires patience, that's mine. You told them that we were supposed to um, that what we have for dinner, but did you tell them that we then ordered wanted to order from the diner? We tried oh, yeah. calling, we couldn't get through. We thought it was our phones. No, it's because the diner was closed, which it never closes. So that's how bad the weather was, that the diner closed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like I said, there was a tornado in South Jersey. Apparently, one um, touchdown close by, right? A uh, town over. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So the kids were pissed off because they didn't have internet. Ooh. The kids and us. We're pissed off about everything. I was pissed off because Dana was pissed off because she was hemming and hawing and annoying the shit out of me all day. Oh, it was hot, honey. Did you even want to think about sleeping in that heat? We're hot with the air on. Could you imagine with the heat? No windows open because we're on the first floor. It's not like you clean the windows open at a ranch. You know that. Now if we Did have you need to know all that? Probably yeah. not. I was thinking about all that. Dana was already thinking about this shit at like 11.31. I was. I was thinking And then about she just kept repeating herself all fucking day and while I was trying to do shit. Able to do it. She was annoying the shit okay, out of me. Okay, start moving that way. Okay, I gotta move this way because like I told you, she's indecent. So, what the hell? Yes, bootleg dinner. We were supposed to order from the diner. Did it get you? Nope, I'm just trying to get a fly. Hot knocker. <laughs> she just uh, cleaned all three guinea pig cages. And I'm gonna go shower. Praise the Lord. Now uh, she's making this big racket. Anyway, somebody's gotta do the dishes. Ain't gonna be me. Exactly, some bitch. I'm not. Toodles. Toodles.